Welcome back to Fox 43 AM Live. I'm very excited. So just coming off of vacation, all I've been hearing about is this ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> so you see our general manager and some other folks from the station were able to try this ice cream and they loved it so much they brought enough for the entire station today. <laughs> this is how good it was. They were saying this is the best ice cream in Kansas. So now please welcome Harley with um, Kansas Premium Meats who sell this ice cream. Good morning. Good morning. And you've got some special guests with I you today. I do. My so, daughters, oh, Brooklyn and Brindley. Daughters? Yes. Okay, hello. Welcome. Hi. Welcome. They, are, they help us at the store a lot. A lot. <laughs> they scoop a lot of ice cream. You guys oh, scoop nice. a lot. Wonderful. Well then, you guys scoop this one, right? No. Okay. <laughs> Do you get Harley paid did. in in ice cream? Mm -hmm. Basically. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, Harley, start out. Um, tell us about Kansas Premium Meats now, because we've focused so much on ice cream, but you guys have so much more going <laughs> we on. We do. Um, so Kansas Premium Meats is a local meat store. Um, we start. We just purchased the business the end of December. Mm -hmm. um, we strive on selling um, local beef, high quality beef. That's all. All we want is high quality and local. Um, and we not only sell beef, we sell pork, bison, elk. Um, lamb, chicken, we've got some whole ducks, some whole turkeys, a little bit of everything. Um, ice cream as well. We've also got quite a few seasonings, some pies, um, jams, granolas. We've got a little bit of everything in there. Wow. Yum. Okay, so I love eating local meat because not only is it more delicious yes. than meat you buy like frozen or from, you know, far off in Texas or whatever, right. but it's also more sustainable for the environment to make sure that you are, um, you know, eating close from close by. You're not you don't have an, as much shipping, you Absolutely. know, going yes. through that. So um, I, I can't wait to try it. One of the things that that we really pride ourselves on, as well as our the beef, has no um, antibiotics, no added hormones, nothing like that. Mm -hmm. um, so we know where our beef is coming from. We know that it's healthy. We know that there's none of that extra nonsense in there so we we we've never had any complaints about any of our meat in the store which I believe we'll that. take it so, uh, so you said the beef's local where is it coming from um, it's coming from Wheaton Kansas okay cool from Mosher Ranch right. is where all of our beef comes from I know Laura was interested a little bit before the show before we started this interview about like Memorial Day is you know just around yes. the corner yes how can people how can people you know um, get so with you guys to get stop for in that? Um, we try really hard to always have everything on hand um, we actually just brought in uh, 30 flavors of brats, which have been a oh, huge hit. Yellow. You name it, we've probably got it in brats. Um, we do have a website um, where you can order in bulk. Unfortunately, our website needs a little love. I'm working on it. <laughs> I'm working on it. Um, but you can order in bulk on our website. Just know that we have individual cuts available that are not listed on the website. Um, you would just have to come to the store, but you can call ahead and I say, hey, it. we need... 20 pounds of steaks, and we'll we'll hook you up. And where are you guys located now? Um, we are on right on Highway 24, mm -hmm. in between um, St. Mary's and Wamego okay. in Bellevue, Kansas. Okay. Little Why city not town. just go have a little road trip out? Yeah, you know, if absolutely. You're based in Topeka, like go and have some ice cream, get some granola, yeah. order some meat. I love it. Yes. Well, you know, with the drive, you know, we were talking about local meats, everything you guys got going on. We have this ice cream on the table now, and now this is also local ice cream made it is. over in K State, right it over is. at the Cal yes. Hall Dairy Bar. Cal Hall Dairy Bar. Yeah. Yes. And you, but you guys are have it at your shop here. So if you're in Topeka, you want some ice cream, you don't have to go all the way to Manhattan for it. You can yes. stop on over at Kansas Premium Meats yes. now. And uh, so tell us about your selection of ice cream because it, is, it looks oh, so, so good. Yummy. It, it is so yummy. <laughs> um, so we do sell the one and a half quarts um, as well as we sell it by the bowl in the store as well. So if you're just passing through and want a little bowl of ice cream on your way, stop by and we'll, we'll get you a bowl of ice cream. Um, the variety is unreal. I think in the store right now we've got 18 different flavors. Um, we kind of just go by whatever they've got to offer at the mm -hmm. time. We we bring in everything we can. Okay, so what do we have today? Let's, yes, let's start with the color. Okay. Let's start with the purple. It's purple pride. So the purple's purple pride. That is K-State's like signature flavor. It's it's like a berry flavor. Mm. Okay. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Don't eat that's, it all, Dane. That's a pretty popular one. <laughs> keep going, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We can share a spoon. We're married. It's <laughs> okay. Was well, so we on the pink one here? Um, mm. The pink one is the strawberry. Mm. Okay, strawberry. Yeah. Mm. Wow. Mm. This is like nice. real, real ice cream. Now it's I heard you. I heard real Laura ice cream. saying with some of my favorite ice creams earlier. I was. Well, yeah, I know. Is that this? He likes what is this one? Chocolate chip cookie dough. She mentioned cookie dough. Okay. We don't have cookie dough, okay, but so. that one is the peanut butter mm. cup. Okay, that just as good. Yeah. And this is like some kind of cherry. That one is strawberry. Oh, strawberry. Yes. Oh, it's so, so good, good, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. It's oh, so creamy. I'm watching creamy. me indulge myself this morning. <laughs> I know. 
<laughs> you so have to get it. Why, I guess, yeah, what made you want to add ice cream to your meat, meat <laughs> so, shop here? Honestly, um, they carried that they did it by the bowl before we bought it mm -hmm. and we kind of contemplated keeping it mm -hmm. we're like ah like do people go to a meat store to buy ice cream i don't know um we ended up bringing in a few of these and they they did really really well um so we're like all right why not and then now that we've progressed further and we're you know talking to more people and meet more people they're like no like do not get rid of this ice cream <laughs> <laughs> yeah that would be always a carry this ice cream and we're like <laughs> Okay, and we have a lot of people that, that buy it for nostalgia purchase mm -hmm. and purposes, honestly. Like, they went to K-State years ago, and they just want some ice cream. Well, I know we have I, one co-worker yeah. here who was saying that. Yeah. Really? Yes. But you've all, so you've got the nostalgic kind of, like, flavors. I know you said you had butter brickle at some point. Um, you've got the sort of cherry choco crunch, which is kind of a classic flavor. But you also have modern mm -hmm. flavors with the um, peanut butter cup. Yes. And mm. another fun thing. So we're in the process of redoing our ice cream bar. Um, we want to get, like, an actual, like, ice cream freezer and have, like, mm -hmm. a setup with toppings. Um, we Another thing I forgot to mention, we make freeze-dried goodies in our store as well. I love those. <laughs> yeah. So we have um, all the freeze-dried candies, we've got freeze-dried apples, um, tomatoes, limes, you name it, we've got it all. Um, and so we started making little containers of ice cream toppings mm -hmm. out of the leftover, like, freeze-dried candy. Yeah. So we've Man, got some little, I'm like... I'm to be making a trip down <laughs> yeah. to Kansas Just so on Highway 24, let's just go after work. I'm yeah. Gonna, yeah, I'm going to go down there, maybe go to Amigo or something, yeah. get some tacos, and go visit Nas Museum with some ice cream. Uh, yeah, that sounds <laughs> like a perfect day. Uh, I'm so wonderful. How can people... What What's your website now? Um, KansasPremiumMeats.com. KansasPremiumMeats.com. Wonderful. Yes. I'm... I want our, to check this out Our this Facebook summer. is definitely our most updated okay. for okay. anybody that's on Facebook. Um, like I said, our, our website's a work in progress, but I'm working on it. Wonderful. I'm working on it. All right. Well, then head on down to Facebook to learn more about Kansas Premier Meats. You're not going to be disappointed. No, I not can, at all. All right. So, so just the dessert <laughs> alone, you're going to be great. All right. <laughs> We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back with more Fox 43 AM Live after this.